Mr. Curry Cup, the greatest domestic rugby tournament in the world. The final, this Saturday. The venue, Durban. The teams, the Sharks and Province. The lineups. <laughs> To the clean and jerk. No surprises here. This episode is dedicated to the Curry Cup. Now, as you heard, Jeb Sinclair is on the bench for Province, and while the Canadian has settled in nicely in SA, there's still one thing he's struggling with Afrikaans. And I, I feel like I could read it easily if it was written down, but geez, the way some of these guys talk at a million miles an hour, it's, it's sort of hard to pick up. Um, but yeah, I mean, some stuff, you know, when you're standing around in lineouts and, and you, you, I am picking it up. I'm not sure if I even notice that I am, but it's certainly going in one ear. Learn any words, Jeb? What is it? Leicester, uh, Asableaf, um, and then the rest I know you probably can't play on the radio station. And how do you deal with your Afrikaans teammates? Here, sometimes some of the boys, like the cock, is very Afrikaans. Sometimes I have to be like, but even when he speaks English, I need an interpreter sometimes. Jeez, that guy, uh, right out of the woods. <laughs> and, and, you know, it, Dion, Phil's man, and Scara, those guys, they look after me. Moving overseas, Francois Boert and Sonny Bill Williams will face each other in November in Brisbane. Billed as the blunder down under, the White Buffalo is clearly not worried about SBW. Are you a bit of a Sonny Bill Williams fan in terms of the way he plays his rugby? <laughs> uh, you know what? Uh, he plays good rugby probably, I don't know. You know I, uh, he's actually a very he's a gentleman, that's, that's who he is. Because uh, I spent some time with him when he was done here in South Africa. But, uh, I mean, listen, in that ring, when that bell rings, there's no, there's no friendship. Look, on the rugby field, he may be able to uh, teach you a few things, but in the ring, it will be different. Well, uh, I think if I, if I, if I, if I, if I, if I, if I wanted to go help the Sharks, but I didn't, I didn't need to. You know, I was there, I was invited there, and, uh, but I thought if the Sharks were going to struggle, I would have to go out in the field and help them, but it wasn't necessary. I think if I play rugby for like two years, I could be a good rugby player too. <laughs> <laughs> There's no doubt that Sundowns are really struggling at the moment, and manager Johan Nieskens is feeling the heat. A journo felt his wrath after their supposed lucky win over Tux this week. Luck. If you see the game tonight, 90 minutes, you cannot talk about luck or not. Or did I see a different game? <laughs> Come on. You have to uh, ask a, a little bit of serious questions, please. 
It is ridiculous. Now finally it's time for our clean and jerk challenge and we put the two captains of the Curry Cup final up to the task. Rafiq Wahid chatted to Dion Ferri, captain of province and Mark Lewis got hold of Keegan Daniel. How many times has the Sharks won the Curry Cup? Do you know how many times the Sharks have won the Curry Cup? 14. Half of that, seven times. So that's uh, one wrong. Second question, how many times have Western Province won the Curry Cup? 29. Very close, 31 actually. So hopefully you'll make it 32. Yeah. Um, who holds the record for the most tries in a Curry Cup season? Currently still playing, so I'll give you a clue. Um, and Western Province, better rivals. Beyond Muscle. Well done. Who scored the most points um, in the history of the Curry Cup? That was Gota. Well done, that's two for you. And what was the score in last year's uh, Curry Cup final? 36-14. Almost there, 42-16 to the Lions. So that's two out of five. I think, um, I think he may have beaten Keegan Daniel. Hopefully you can follow that through on the weekend. Yeah, it's a good start, eh? <laughs> With us now, the uh, captain of the Sharks, Keegan Daniel. Keegan, first question up for you. Uh, as I say, we'll keep it rugby-based to make this a little bit simple for you. Uh, how many Curry Cup titles have the Sharks won over the years? I'm going to go with six. Ooh, goes to seven, Keegan. So let's uh, see if you can make it eight this weekend. Uh, if we jump ahead to Western Province, have any idea how many titles Western Province have won? Uh, sure, Western Province. They've probably won quite a few. I'm actually not sure on that one. Remarkably, it goes up to 31, I'm afraid. Uh, yeah, that, I knew that was very strong in that area, yeah. <laughs> Tell me, who holds the record for the most tries in a Curry Cup season? Uh, Bjorn Besson. Oh, spot on, well played. Who scored the most points in history in a Curry Cup? Lars Berta. Well done. Then finally, uh, this this I'm, I'm hoping you will know. What is the uh, What was the score in last year's final? Well, we scored 16 and did the Lions score... It was absolutely absolute hammering. Uh, <laughs> I know we all only scored 16. How many did I get? 42, Keegan. 42. Uh, so it's another 45, points. but I don't want to give him too many points. <laughs> so, two out of five for both captains. Could that be a microcosm of what will happen in the final? Let's hope not. We definitely want to win. We certainly don't want to draw. So, watch the Curry Cup final and join us next time on the Clean and Jerk.